ladies and gents, hello, welcome to another Hull City match day vlog. Today it is Hull City versus Cardiff. It's going to be a difficult one, a very difficult one. But you know what? I'm confident I'm, we can go into this game with a bit of confidence. And yes. So what have I done today so far? I've had a haircut, gone to the gym. Now it's time for the Tigers against Cardiff. I'll put the teams on screen. We've got new vlog graphics and let's get to the game.
hilarious dude. We've got McGinnis on Aidan Flynn. Well done, Brandon. Does he? Never. Why can't he kick a ball? Oh, oh Kevin! Mark the big man. Ooh, the most absolute horse poo free kick ever. Score from this, I'm going to be very, I very so annoyed. Oh. It annoys me when teams cheat like that. Yeah, no. It annoys me when teams cheat. <laughs> Free kick. It should have been a bucket for Flint. It wasn't. Bowen and Grzycki standing over it. You can get it over this it's, got, it's got to be Bowen, I think. And then, what a goal by Grzycki, what a goal, Jesus Christ, I'm still absolutely shaking from it, <laughs> it was too good, as for the rest of the half, Cardiff, a, you can tell the Neil Warnock team, so dirty, so long ball, the only way they're going to get chances is set pieces and those long throw-ins that um, Sean Morrison puts in and when they're down the other end in this uh, second half I'm going to be absolutely pooing my pants, guaranteed but um, what I can say is we have played pretty alright Cardiff haven't looked too threatening they've hit the bar once that's about it but what we do need is, with Stuart booked, we need an extra bit of bite in midfield. We were discussing it up there during the half. We need Honeyman on. Honeyman or Batty, but more Honeyman. Because Honeyman's got that bit of bite in him. He's got that more like desire to just go tough tackle with the ball. So yeah, I think Honeyman would be a good option. We're not looking very good on the main man front either. Josh McGuinness has looked more of a defender than he has an attacker. Every time he's dropping back and always been the furthest man back, last one to get forward. I say we get no bad Balogun immediately. 
Because I tell you what, I don't trust these. I don't trust these. There's the Murphy brothers, isn't there? Yeah. Because one of them plays for West Brom, I think. Josh Murphy on. It's the 71st minute. We need someone else on. We need Balog on, I think. We need Balog and someone else in midfield, maybe. Cardiff are going to look quite, quite different now because they've got that bit of pace about them in Murphy and Mendes Lang. It's going to be a big threat, especially for Fleming. And is Murphy playing up top? striker that you got on the bench. No bad Balog. But what you just said, Gordon, I think it might be right. He won't bring him on until they've scored a second. And it might happen now. Corner's whipped in. Oh! Our free kick because they obstructed the goalkeeper. Nice. He's put Honeyman on the wing. He did that against Reading. Ready for, for his God debut. God knows. Honeyman was on the wing. I mean, give it your best shot, Honeyman. Time to shine. Nice, it's our free kick. Nice, nice. We got away with that. Entire six minutes, my heart will be pounding at its fastest rate it's ever gone. Good God! City, all you had to do was hold on, not make any stupid mistakes. And what have you done? Come on, five more minutes, come on, boys. Come on, City! You deserve this win! Come on! 
subscribers during the game so yeah but I mean we deserve to win we deserve that result we didn't deserve the draw we didn't deserve the draw but it's what we've got but we'll come back here on Tuesday just fingers crossed playing the same way Anyway, that's where I'm going to leave this. Hope you enjoyed it. You should smack a like on it. Subscribe if you're new. Six, road to 600 starts here. And I'll see you on Monday for the preview for Hull City versus Sheffield Wednesday. See you then. Ciao. Up the tyres. Come on, you all. <laughs>